Hello, my beautiful Virgos. Welcome to my channel. This is Divine Light, and today we're going to be looking into your financial forecast for the next four weeks. I'm going to jump right in to see what's happening here in your cup. Towards the end, we're going to see your saucer and your cards. I see here, okay, in your heart, you might be feeling a little bit stressed. By the way, I changed the setup, the camera. If this is your new here, and also you have been watching for a while, let me know if you enjoy this uh, angle here, okay? Oh, there was an opening in your heart. Now I see like the bottom of the face, like a half bottom of someone's face right there. I don't know if you guys can see here. The face is not clear. It seems like within the third week that you might be actually coming across from with someone uh, like I said, their eyes and the head is not very clear. So this can be someone who has a talking ability. Um, the air signs tend to be intellectual and they can actually articulate words really well. Can be a Gemini, Libra or an Aquarius coming forward here to talk to you. There's a pathway opening before them, though maybe I feel like you might be even traveling towards this person. Okay. Um, let's see what's happening within the first week. I see two people putting their heads together, having a conversation, and there's like a dragon or maybe even salamander, like a fire breathing, fire, new energy, and um, adventure, entrepreneur spirit, new beginning, like that kind of energy is actually flying over you with this person. This can be someone, if you're actually building your own business, that you are going to put your heads together. I see a letter M as in Matthew. Amanda can be in the first name or the last name of a person. It doesn't have to be initials. Seems like here you're going to sit down side by side, not across from each other. So this can be a partnership thing that you're going to talk together. Okay. And it seems like it has very light energy above it. I even see like a silhouette of, you see, I think this is Ganesh. I'm not really sure. The, the elephant head, um, uh, the god. And seems like... Elephant indicates actual long-term stability, financial security. It seems like with this person, whatever that you're talking about, has massive financial security and potential in the future. I see there's another person here walking away. They have a bun above their head. This can be someone, bun meaning have their thoughts together, okay? Um, I think in the hair, actually, in Native Americans, they have uh, meaning. Um, the thing is, I think when you actually release your hair, it is about the freedom. When you put it together, like in a bun or tie it or braid it, it actually means like putting your mind, like the, the organizing your thoughts and like, um, you know, articulating them in a well, um, you know, maintains, you know, order basically creating order it seems like here this person has some sort of like order in their mind but their order is not really resonating with what you're discussing with this person so they're choosing to walk away but what they're walking away they have a brick wall in front of them i don't think they can go so far so this person might be actually coming back again hmm in in a non-happy way okay this can even be Maybe like um, if you're working right there somewhere, like if you're working in a building, this can be someone entering, trying to enter into it too. We can like look at it in a different, two different aspects here. We can disconnect the events from here. This can even be someone trying to get inside of this endeavor that you're, brick, that you're building, this brick building here, okay? Seems like um, there's going to be a contract coming forward. So you're if you're allowing someone in there, you're going to allow them with a contract. You're not going to let them come in right away. This can even be like a new contract offer coming forward for you when you make a decision to leave some people out, okay? By the way, I'm going to leave a link up here for private readings. If you would like one from me, you can go ahead and check those ones out. And if you are new here, haven't subscribed already, and if you're enjoying these, don't forget to give it a thumbs up and hit subscribe to join the beautiful soul community. And the subscription is free. You can unsubscribe anytime you want. After this legal paper, it seems like the legal paper signing coming forward in the second week. In the third week, there's another second legal paper coming forward. And I see here a tall tower, the birds flying over it. Uh, this tall tower, I was recently actually, like today I was watching Lord of the Rings. I don't know if you guys know about the Lord of the Rings. It's like one of my favorites. 
um, books and movie. And um, the Eye of Sauron, all-seeing eye, watching everything. Um, actually, like kind of like seems like um, the matri uh, the patriarchy. Okay. Uh, in one end when you look at it i see there's an all-seeing eye here there's a bird actually flying over it coming towards you and i feel like this is something positive on your end as well this can be something that may be left in there that is owed to you maybe applied for something that didn't receive it yet seems like here the news about it the good news because the white paper is coming forward the good news about it is going to be coming forward in the third week okay i see here and um, the pathway opening there's a chunk of money coming forward this is actually brick building the brick building can be like a governmental office an outside path i don't know if you have like relatives in another country another city outside of your comfort zone seems like here there's a the news of a chunk of money you can see the chunk right there will be arriving to you this can even be when I say the news coming forward, this can even be maybe you hearing about, like if you apply to certain things, do certain things in a way, they will bring you financial security. They might bring you some financial security, maybe a discount on some things that you need to pay can be some sort of a thing like that as well. But this is something unexpected outside of comfort zone can be from an even like a different country coming forward to you. When it comes to third week, you're receiving the legal paper. I see another person here. She has like a paintbrush in her hand, sitting down. There are three people under her painting. Now I look at this angle. This looks like a baby eagle being fed uh, by its mother. The eagle actually symbolizes government and also maybe freedom, being free and establishing your own self it seems like this three people helping the third person uh the paint a brush i feel like you can be the person that has the creative idea and receiving the three people maybe at work people are going to come through help you out build this thing or maybe you are becoming a team a part of this team to build uh, help this person to show their talent do whatever they do best and what happens is all together as a group as a collective you're going to be receiving this freedom this baby bird this baby eagle is actually going to be uh, uh, getting out of like the you know the shell basically uh, so if you're being offered some sort of like um union coming together helping people if that kind of a thing even though it seems like it, it doesn't have nothing to do with what you're wanting at this moment with your life right now it can actually expand you to another level okay i see here towards the end of the month there is you can see the silhouettes of one two three people there is a baby here and the silhouettes actually being surrounded by shadow i feel like these are not really clear right now you cannot really guess or fathom how this is going to come to come true okay and um, but it seems like you're going to be stepping in an environment which is actually very like-minded people i even see like a teddy bear here teddy bear can be an investor investor by the way bears usually symbolize someone powerful and strong and this teddy bear can be investing in the ideas of these three people and it seems like here you're going to become a part of this collective okay if you are actually like investing in something this can even be schoolwork. if you want to go to school this can be like um finding your environment finding where you belong to where you can actually do that like uh, learn as much as you can and support each other and grow each other with this community when you step into that okay there is a beautiful community though you're going to be um not only like working making money you're going to actually become a part of this thing that you're going to be building something together with these people let's get into your plate now if you have a question a desire and intention hold it in your mind there was actually a chunk of money staying here and i feel like that is going to be coming really fast forward to into your life as well your desire is a yes it's a quick yes and it's going to be happening really soon and it seems like here um like if even if this is something that you have been waiting for a long time and i see another crescent moon here which usually symbolize governmental the structure of the government and like uh the tears of joy even fell out it is going to come to come to uh, come to life basically Okay, I see here, this kind of looks like a moon as well with a face and it's carrying, um, I feel like a little baby chicken, but this one has a crown. So uh, if this is like a promotion, this is an upgrade in your life. If you want to become the leader for many, it seems like that is actually going to be happening too. 
as you can see, it's an extremely light energy. It's not heavy. It doesn't have a lot of residue. And you don't really have many people surrounding you as well. So it seems like even though you become a leader, you're not going to be uh, carrying a heavy burden of dealing with these people. This can be even like a um, self-managing environment that you're going to become a part of. Okay. But double crescent moon, one of them has a face. The, the faced one can be i want to interpret it in like a governmental sense maybe like uh this can be also governmental approval that you're going to be getting and that can be like showing that because now we have like a face in the governments there's a person like there like um in every country it doesn't matter where you are there is someone when you knock on the door that opens the door so that's i feel like that can be the face here okay that you're going to be dealing with but it seems like they're going to be approaching a little serious face I see, I look at it here, a little serious face, but um, um, bright aura, which is actually indicative that they're going to be really helpful to you. Let's get into your cards. Let's see what's happening with the first week. We have Nine of Pentacles. Nine of Pentacles actually indicates that your all your hard work will be paying off. If you have been working on a project, something, whatever it is, that is going to start to give you the fruit that's going to start to bear fruit and you're going to be enjoying those fruits very well very soon okay let's see the second one we have the queen of swords the second is the same position even though i shuffled it came forth let's see at the bottom she's coming with the energy of the cat here cats are actually about like self-care and the this can be you expressing your desires. By the way, if you have Taurus in your chart, like I said, it came in the same position, but the interpretation was to totally different. I feel like this is you expressing your desires because it seems like here with the Eight of Cups on the bottom, you are walking away from something that you're over and done with now. You're completing a subject, you're completing a cycle, whatever it is that you have been there, done that. And now you're telling, maybe this is like a position that you have been working for a very long time. Now you want to upgrade, that will be coming. But maybe that upgrade is not going to be so, some sort of satisfying for you financially. Yes, satisfying, but maybe mentally you're going to want more and you're going to express that. Or this can even be when you like uh, manifest the money, wealth. You're just going to walk away from something like you're going to say, you know what? I don't need to work on this anymore. I can just go ahead and move on from that. We have six of cups here. This can be someone coming into your life uh, from your past childhood. And I also usually in financial readings interpret this as maybe you have a childhood dream that you're going to have the opportunity to make this happen. And this can even be something lightly, childish, maybe, but joyful, enjoyable, that is going to be showing up an opportunity or something that is like an inspiration coming forward that you're going to be able to uh, create a transformation with. Queen of Wands, mm, okay, this is very strange, exactly the same position, it came forward. I feel like Whatever this is idea with the Taurus, by the way, this is a shuffle deck. You saw that I shuffled it and I just put this anyways. Um, so I feel like you need to hear a lot of feminine energy is going on here. And Queen of Wands, the strong feminine character, can be Aries Leo Sagittarius, someone that is coming forward to maybe uh help you kickstart this new idea, new project. Okay, let's see what the bottom says. Eight of Wands. Okay. Uh, that's now I'm thinking, yes, this is a person who's going to help you <clears throat> start this new project really fast. And at the end, we have the star here. This project is going something that you want for a very long time. And you're going to be getting some sort of like a, either divine help or maybe, like I said, like someone like a, with extreme feminine energy will be coming forward to help you. But at the end of the day, this is your wish fulfillment. This is your desire. So you don't need to worry about that, okay? This person can come up a little bit fiery because fire signs tend to be fiery. But it doesn't matter. They're going to be like doing their best to actually get you to the next level on this project, okay? Let's see. We have new supportive connections. Yes, this approves that, basically. I feel like, yeah. This is exactly what's going to happen. Someone, whoever this person showing up, will be actually supporting you with this new endeavor. And I feel like Nine of Pentacles is actually enjoying the creation of the, yeah, the, your, um, the, the manifestations, basically, of collecting the fruits of your manifestations and like enjoying that. And it seems like here 
you're going to be doing that like with new people you're going to build something brand new also you're going to be kindred partnerships this usually indicates romance but i feel like in this one here this is not only romance but it's also going to be some some people that you're going to like i said just click really well right away okay so if you're feeling like you you're not in the mood to deal with new people maybe it's time to just socialize and connect okay i tell you we have air signs we have fire signs here um six of cups can be water signs we have all of them here okay we have the earth signs aquarius energy here with the star and fire heavy though fire heavy and yeah let's get to your guardians animal guardian trust your instincts so you're going to be guided okay and that's a your gut is going to actually lead you towards these people and the sun enjoys success and happiness definitely success coming for you you don't really have any process or long like old uh, pathways that you need to walk through here and the other signs like i started with taurus i feel like they have some sort of like a pathway they need to walk through but it seems like here you just follow your intuition enjoy your life and do what you want to do because you're already on the way okay and we have the bobcat spirit life is a mystery okay embrace the mystery by the way like i said in the beginning you're going to be entering towards the end of the month maybe entering into a crowd that is going to actually have people that you don't know and that mystery actually is going to be something reveal something good for you okay so enjoy the mystery as well okay right my beautifuls that's all for today hope you enjoy your reading if you do don't forget to give this one a thumbs up and if you want to see more of these go ahead and subscribe to my channel i wish you all a magical day bye